huge field of junior Yamahas. Take the start, they're three wide straight over the start finish line. Chris Cox down the inside. There's lots of muscling going on through the first few rows. Mitch 11's got a pretty good start to slot into fourth from grid number six. There was a fair bit going on in the midfield there up in the top corner. And Chris Cox continuing on with his weekend domination. He's time trialed quickest on both days. Was headed by Nick Cassidy, who started a fair way back here after some problems on the first day in heat one yesterday. But Chris Cox has since won the second heat, the pre-final, and heat three as we look at the heat four action. Mitch Levin's trying to work some pressure on James Hadley, who in turn got passed by the 50 of Jesse Craig from Christchurch. So it's Christchurch one and two. Wellington third with James Hadley in the 27 running the Intrepid chassis. And there's our first side of Nick Cassidy, already threw in the fifth, running the only Marinello chassis in the field. More known here in New Zealand as a very, very good senior gearbox KZ2 and open class chassis. But Nick Cassidy's been very, very quick straight out of the box with this car. Chris Cox leads, Jesse Craig second, James Hadley third, defending there from Mitchell Evans. Little touch there from Nick Cassidy as he went by between Cassidy and Evans. So Evans gets shuffled back in the order. Has struggled a little bit this weekend. Two former New Zealand junior restricted champions, Cassidy and Evans. So things just starting to settle down up front now with Chris Cox still leading from Jesse Craig. James Hadley under pressure here from Cassidy. Mitchell Evans is in fifth. Then we go back to Jacob Ross. One of the top Hawke's Bay locals in the 66. Certainly a lot of experience around the Hawke's Bay Car Club track. Cassidy goes by James Hadley to third. So Cassidy's on the move here. He was down outside the first three rows off the grid for the fourth heat. And a good result here would see him move up the order for the grid for the final. David Mazaris there in the 17's gone by Jacob Ross. There's the five. Hydrolink arrow of Levi Madsen Print. Cassidy this time goes down the inside under brakes on Jesse Cray. Goes through to second. Starts chasing down Chris Cox as the 66 of Jacob Ross has a problem. He's spun off to the outside of the track at turn number one. As Chris Cox now on his last lap. Heat number four of Junior Yamaha, sponsored by the efficient Carrying Co. and the Cycle and Cart Centre Napier. So Cox just controlling the pace out in front. Former South Island champ. He's going to take the win in heat four with the yellows out at the last corner. Cox takes the win from Nick Cassidy. That's a big charge through the field. Jesse Craig third, followed by David Mazaris, Mitchell Evans and James Hadley in sixth.